I'm good. I think I started 20 years ago wanting to have a film that examined what was happening in America during those years. I think what I thought about it then, and I still do, is that the challenges didn't drive us apart, Jack and I. It made us feel like it's the two of us against the world. Don't let them get to you. I won't. I hate to say it, but it was supportive of our marriage rather than dis destructive. I think for me, the most interesting thing about their love story is that she is still so loyal and devoted and enamored by him till this day. We've been engaged five years and put off getting married until I graduated from college and until he had a job. And the most exciting part of that was he had a job, you know. <laughs> and, oh, oh my! He hits Jackie Robinson right in the head. If they knew you, they would be ashamed. I feel why this is a love story. They cherish that space that they had together. <laughs> they had to keep that space pure. You can see how they sort of covered each other. Rachel traveled with the team because there was no one there for Jack as a companion. And vice versa, there was no one there for her as well. But they were together day and night. Head of the plate now is Dr. Lucky Jackie Robinson. She's an inspiring, fascinating woman and very much interested in preserving her husband's legacy. It's not black history, African-American history. It's American history. And the things that are noble about America are really represented in this story. I want you to know I'm pulling for you to make good. You can go through really terrible times, but if you form relationships to keep you strong, you can make a difference. <laughs>